The gift the gods gave me is that I cannot be bullied anymore. Had lots of really weird feelings about about um Aegis, like Thalia's shield thing, because it is like everybody really likes that, and I get why they would like it. Obviously, it's a sword with like Medusa's head on it, but I was like, I really don't like the idea of Athena being like, here, abusive dad. I made you a sword with a woman a that shield. was like, yeah, a shield that has a woman that was raped by one by my sibling, and her head is on it, and I'm presenting it to you as a prize. Yeah, it's like, icky. And then the idea that uh, Thalia just like has it and is just like using it, I'm like, this makes me so depressed that a like a rape survivor is like stuck just her head is just stuck on a shield and it's not even really her it's like a diluted version of her but the only thing that has survived is just like what Poseidon did to her yeah and that's the only thing that's left and I was just like I'm so depressed <laughs> reading this right now that she was like you know taken down to like just that and it that's 100% because the TV show made Medusa's myth like the better version of it and made her more of a person. Mm. I would say Medusa's backstory, but there's yeah. two backstories. I would say I like this one more, but the Gorgon Sisters one's also pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. And so when I see that, I'm like, oh God, like no rape survivor deserves to be like remembered only for what the person did to you and nothing else. Yeah. Like that really sucks that she's, that that's like, her her shield but i get it but now that that rick like put much more like emotion behind medusa that just feels it just feels so wrong that that athena did that to her in the first place and then it just feels so weird that a zeus kid that doesn't really understand any of this context is just like using it without even understanding what's really what really happened to her yeah um i wonder if they'll address that it's it's kind of just accept like I hate to put it that way, but in mythology, it's kind of just accepted that that's that's how Athena's shield looks, and yeah. um, I I think it probably goes back to misogynistic society and you know men being unable to empathize with a woman who has been a victim of something like that, mm -hmm. um, because I I can understand like theoretically philosophically. You know, certain people, when they do go through very traumatic things, do turn into a villain sometimes or, or act villainous. Um, I, I don't want to say turn into a villain because, like, in real life, there's not villains and good guys. Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, like, it, it is a thing that sometimes our trauma leads us to do things that greatly hurt other people. And sometimes that is going to be the only thing we're remembered for. And um that sucks i mean there definitely is a part of me that's like all of the stupid and selfish and immature things that i've done in my life haunt me still you know mm -hmm. um and i know they hurt certain people but um i hope that's not the only way i'm remembered i hope that the the trauma being projected onto people or uh being you know like used against them even when i wasn't realizing i was doing it doesn't have me as a villain in their head yeah i think about that stuff too like i don't know what people think about me like that like mm -hmm. i just remember all the people that i knew in my life before the last couple years i was like i know that i was like all over the place and i don't even know like what it was like to be around me for most of those years because i don't remember and also because i was just there were like too many things that I was trying to deal with in no good ways because there was no good way to deal with all of that stuff. Yeah. And so I think about that too of like, I know that I was dealing with way too many things like more than a normal person can deal with usually. But at the same time, I know that I was a bad friend to a lot of people and I like almost like wonder like, are there people out there who hate me? Or like think that I'm a horrible person because of how I treated them and I don't even rem some of the time I don't even remember what I could have done to them. Um, but it's one of those weird things of like, I don't like the idea of people thinking that way about me because I don't want I don't want that to be the only thing. And also with me, the other thing I think is like, I don't want to be like this weird 
sad story that just like makes people feel sad or like or yeah. makes them feel guilty about whatever like because that also is something that i know happens with people and i don't want that like didn't like about the whole medusa thing is this idea that the only thing that has survived about her is what happened to her because she was raped by a god and just the idea that that's the only thing that people know about her i'm like she was an actual person though and had an entire life before this happened to her but this is the only thing that anybody knows about her in like this story anymore and it does like because the tv show did such a good job of mm -hmm. humanizing her and like percy very much like sees her as a as like a person and even though she ends up trying to hurt them he still understands why she's upset and things mm -hmm. like that and so it makes me wonder that when they get to this season like if he'll have a weird reaction to that stuff because because they actually met medusa Mm -hmm. And they went through a whole thing of like humanizing her. But yeah, like I don't I don't want people I don't want people to remember me when I was a huge mess and that's the only thing they know about me. Yeah. But I also don't want them to like remember me as just like somebody whose life is so depressing that it makes them feel guilty about their own life. And I'm like, if you're doing that with me, I'd rather you just forget about me completely. <laughs> yeah. Just, bye. I'm not <laughs> getting on the horn. Bye. Yeah, like that's like the that's like the worst options out there. Um, all this because she has Medusa on her sword, on her shield. But it's just it's Medusa. It's it's a it's a it's a rape victim. And I'm like, oh god, this is the only one that I know of. At least there there obviously could be more. It's Greek mythology.